Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Carson Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate Windows 7 in place upgrades to Windows, I'm sorry, Windows 7 to Windows 10 built 1909. So I'm going to test, test the test sequence to see if it works. Um, so I got Windows 7 here, Windows 7. Let's see, I think it's Service Pack 1. No, nope, it's just a regular Windows 7. And let's look at my test sequence for Windows 10 in place upgrades to 1909. The test sequence is pretty basic. So here's the um, all the tests. And my image upgrade is Windows 10. 1909 enterprise versions apply the basic drivers install third-party apps a third-party security set default windows um, apply settings there's not much here just pretty basic uh, windows upgrade uh, windows in place upgrade so now let's get started let's go back to my test machine I'm going to launch the software center. Let me create um, some documents. And go to pictures. So this data should not wiped out. Let's go to C C drive and create a folder called migration tests. Let's put a file in here. Let's put a tech document and another bitmap. All right, so let's see operating system. Here's the uh, in-place upgrade from Windows 7 to Windows 1909. Click restart. I'm sorry, click start. Um, click install. Here it goes. So this is going to take at least 20 to 30 minutes. I'm going to pause the video and then continue when it makes more progress. It's downloading boot whim. Downloading install WIM. Ninety six percent complete. Running actions upgrade upgrade operating system. Fifty percent complete. All right, it just rebooted. Now it's working on the updates. One percent completed. All right, it's rebooting. 
Let's give it a few minutes. Thirty percent complete. All right, eighty five percent. All right, it just restarted. All right, look like the upgrade has completed. I'm going to log in. All right, look like it's finished. Let me um, check the Windows versions. Type in Winver. As you can see here, version 1909. And let's take a look at the files. Here it is, the folder I created before the upgrade. Another one here, and another one here. So, in place upgrade should work from Windows 7 to Windows 10 1909. And I hope you guys like the video. If you do, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. My channel will cover everything related to SCCM, Office 365, and Azure. Thank you for watching. Please have a great day.